Uh, the Neanderthals were probably our closest relatives uh, and they lived in Europe and Asia many thousands of years ago and one of the issues is when did they die out? The new work has taken um, information from a lot of Neanderthal sites, dated nearly 200 samples, to really show what the pattern of their disappearance was and also when the first modern humans appeared in Europe. It suggests that Neanderthals were uh, around until about 39,000 years ago and then we lose any, any sight of them all the way from Spain across to Russia. Now that's a new picture because many people thought the Neanderthals had lingered on in some areas as late as 30,000 years. This suggests they'd gone by 39,000 years ago and that means we can focus in on that date and really look at the factors that might lie behind their disappearance. We've got a replica of one of the last Neanderthals. And so we can say this Neanderthal was about 42,000 years old. And here we've got a, a modern human skull. Now, we know that many modern humans have a bit of Neanderthal DNA in them from interbreeding. Now, we think that interbreeding happened in Western Asia more than 50,000 years ago. This study looks at the period really between 40 and 45,000 years as an overlap in Europe. So we have quite a complicated story. First of all, an overlap in Asia with some interbreeding, and then later on an overlap in Europe before they disappear. We need to really pin down uh, more accurately where the Neanderthals were and the modern humans. We can say they coexisted, but just how closely did they coexist? Were they ever in the same regions at the same time?